Ensure the wedge clip is fully engaged by squeezing the top and bottom together. After removing the connector's dust cap, insert it into the visual fault identifier. Slide the 900 micron boot onto the fiber. Then slide the 250 micron protective tubing on. Using the strip length template, mark the fiber at 25 millimeters. Now strip off 25 millimeters of the coating. Check the fiber's integrity by bending the stripped end at about 60 degrees. Clean the stripped fiber to remove any coating elements. Set the fiber onto the cleaver so that the coating's edge is between the 10 and 11 millimeter mark. Now cleave the fiber. Insert the cleaved fiber into the rear of the connector. The red light on the wedge clip should now be dim. Slide the 250 micron protective tubing into the connector until it stops. Push the fiber toward the connector to make a slight bend. Squeeze both sides of the wedge clip to activate the splice, then remove the wedge clip. Remove the VFI and reinstall the dust cap. Push the boot on firmly. The termination process is now complete.